Hello, welcome to this lesson uh, in engineering mechanics. We're going to work this problem, a three-dimensional vector problem. Uh, hopefully by doing problems you will solidify our understanding of what we've been talking about. So here we have a vector f. The magnitude is 1,500 pounds, so the length of this vector is 1,500 pounds. And what we are given are the direction angles. So we know that this angle is 65 degrees, this angle to the y-axis is 31.6, this angle to the x-axis is 72 degrees. Now anytime you draw a picture in a two-dimensional space, that you're trying to draw a three-dimensional uh, picture, things can look a little distorted. For instance, this is 72 degrees, but it looks like a really, really wide angle. That's because it's very hard to see, even though you do your best, it's hard to really see how um, how this vector really looks in three-dimensional space. Notice this angle here is, is pretty decent amount, less than 90 degrees, but it looks like almost 180 degrees or something on the board. So let me draw or uh, pick up our little prop that we have here. We're not going to do this for every problem, but I'll, I'll do it here just to kind of uh, try a little bit to, to explore these direction angles a little bit. So on the board we have an XYZ axis like this, and we have our vector which is pointed like this. Now what this is telling us, what this 65 degrees is telling us, is that the um, let me see if I can get it oriented about right, it's pretty close to something like that. You can, I'll rotate it for you and you can see how it looks in three-dimensional space. It's not exact, it's pretty, pretty decent though. What this is saying is the angle between the vector direct angle, if you were to sweep through a plane here to the z-axis is 65 degrees. It would say that if you go and take this angle, notice that the, the vector sticks out in relation to y, but we're looking at the direct angle, we're looking at the direct angle to the y-axis, that's 31 degrees. And this angle here is, look at this, less than 90 degrees, it's 72 degrees.